Hi guys, it's Dear Natural 62. I'm coming today with a tag. It is the Nail Polish Obsession Tag. I've gotten a lot of requests on what's my favorite nail polishes, um, what brands do I like, what brands do I use. So I figured this would be a great way and I've seen this tag so many times and I was like, you know what, this encompasses everything that everyone's been asking me. So I thought I'd do this tag for you. I hope you enjoy. Definitely don't forget to like this video if you like this tag. So let's get started. I'll list the questions down below in the description bar. And of course, I'm tagging everyone that sees this video. And you know, the first two people that actually do this tag from my request and mention my name in their videos, I'll add them to the bottom as a video response to this video. Sounds good? I think so. So let's get started. First question, what's your favorite nail polish brand? Believe it or not, even though I screwed up the name some in the beginning of my videos, because I kept saying Sally Henson instead of Sally Hansen, um, <laughs> and people were calling me out on that, um, but that is my favorite brand, and it's actually the Extreme Wear. Um, I love this line because of the bright colors. I love the sheen that you get from the finish, and I just absolutely love them. And especially for my water marble videos, they are one of the best brands to use with your water marble videos because the consistency is on a thinner side, so they spread in the water much easier. So it's no trouble. So, of course, that's my favorite brand of nail polish. Number two, glitter or no glitter? Hmm, I'm sorry. As much as I love glitter, I'm gonna have to say no glitter. And the reason why is glitter is so beautiful. And it is something I do wear, but I do not wear this on an everyday basis because Glitter is a pain to take off your nails. Yes, I've learned techniques to take them off with foil and everything. I'm not saying that. But it takes time to get off. And you still feel like there's like little residues of glitter on your nails. So that's why this is not an everyday for me. I have to say, no glitter. <laughs> Next question. Favorite brands, OPI, China Glaze, or Essie? If I'm choosing between the three, what I'm gonna do is categorize them. I would say China Glaze, number one, OPI, number two, Essie, number three. That's the order I would put them in. Question number four, when do you change your nail polishes? Now, of course, if you've seen my videos, and I do a lot of nail videos, and if I'm not doing nail videos, what you guys might not know, you have to follow me on Instagram. I'm always showing new designs, new colors, um, new nail polishes that I bought. So definitely check me out on Instagram. I change my nail polish very often. In. Um, I'm not going to say it's every day, but we're looking like every two days, every three days, something like that. Um, and it's because, it's because of the videos, it's because of Instagram, it's because of Twitter. Um, I also post pics on Pinterest. So definitely follow me on all those places so you can see all the different designs I come up with. Because I don't necessarily do videos on all of them. But you know what? Hmm... I might do a slideshow. Would you be interested in that? Let me know if you'd be interested in seeing a slideshow of various nail designs that I've come up with. All in one place. Hmm. I tell you, when the light bulb goes off, you just gotta say it so you can remember it. Moving on. Number five. What's your favorite color on your nails? Hands down. It has to be blue. Um, and the two different blues, it's the Blow Me Away from Sally Henson and it's Blagger from Butter. Yes, there are two different shades of blue, but both of them look gorgeous on my nails. Um, the colors just just jump out at you. I, I'm just fascinated with blues. I just absolutely love these two colors right now. Number six, dark or bright? Hmm, I'm gonna have to say bright stands out to me. I love designs that just pop and pop of color looks gorgeous on your nails especially sometimes if you have like a job where you're wearing all 
black or you're wearing uniform or you're wearing like some type of muted colors a pop of color on your nail always does the trick and you can see all the celebrities too especially when they're wearing like black evening gowns or one tone evening gowns you'll see a pop of color on their nails I absolutely love it number seven what are you wearing on your nails at this very moment that would have to be I am currently wearing China Glaze Fast Track on my nails right now. Um, I just wanted something neutral today. No fuss, no muss. It's like a go-to. It has a little glitter and shimmer to it. It's very cute. It's a very pale taupe with a gold iridescent shimmer to it, which is very cute, subtle, and classy. I love it. Number eight, matte. Is it in or is it out? I'd like to say in. I love matte, especially on a beautiful French. You can do a muted tone, a matte tone all over your nails. This is a tip. You can do a matte all over your nails and do a high gloss French at the bottom. And it looks absolutely gorgeous. So for me, I want to say matte is in. I absolutely love it. I love how it makes the nails look. The two textures of contrast on your nails look absolutely good. So for me, Matt is in. Number nine, French manicure. Now, I used to do a lot of French manicure when I was like in high school, believe it or not. Um, I just thought it looked clean, it looked simple. But I haven't worn a traditional French manicure since high school, and that was a long time ago. <laughs> I'm just saying, it's just not for me anymore. It's just too simple because I just absolutely love color and I love expressing myself through my nails and it just seems shall I say a tad bit boring just a tad I'm just saying I'm just saying um number 10 what is your favorite winter color one of my favorite winter colors is china glaze hook and line i absolutely love it because it to me it's not really a color you can only wear during the winter but it fits well in the winter it has a nice iridescent um sheen to it it's very nice um it is a darker color so it goes well and it's not too too dark i don't like going too too dark on my nails um that's another story for my toes but for my nails i try to keep it light fun and i like for people to talk about my nails it's just something like whenever <laughs> Whenever I'm anywhere, you know, I absolutely love it when people are like, oh my God, those are so cute. That design is so cute. I love the conversation. I love the interaction. And it is a chatterbox. My nails. So, I hope you've enjoyed this tag. I've enjoyed doing it. And let me put to rest a water marble video is coming this week. So definitely keep those color combos coming and what I wanted to share with people is now from now on I will not only be taking suggestions from YouTube but I will also be taking suggestions on my Facebook fan page, Twitter, Instagram and you can follow me at all of those at Dear Natural 62 If you leave a color combo on there I'll be sure to get it. Trust me I try to respond to everyone. That within itself is a job, but I try to respond to everyone and I want to thank everyone because the gold is happening and I want to remind everyone, you know the gold for me? I'm going to make a year. It's going to be a year on YouTube. I can't believe it, but I've enjoyed every moment of it. It's going to be a year July 18th next month week and my ideal goal for myself was to try to reach a million views before July 18th and I promised if I did I'd be having a huge giveaway <laughs> I thought that was so cute um so definitely if you can help me reach that million views I would greatly appreciate it so tell your friends tell everyone watch dear natural 62 she's funny she's creative she's sassy she's a little quirky but you know she keeps you entertained that bottom line that's the main objective for me when I watch videos I want somebody that keeps me entertained 
So definitely check me out on Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, and don't forget to sub, you know, Dear Natural 62. Take care. Bye-bye.